Y'all ever just look at yourself and be like, dang. Oh, I look this cute. <laughs> Even though you're in a house don't mean though that you're safe. Ever say I'm moving, pounds don't mean that I'm moving weight. I'm back, 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 back. I'm back, 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 back. With another video for my J babies. <laughs> video is today's video is just going to be my natural hair journey so this video is basically to just answer all y'all questions give y'all tips on how to grow your hair all that type of stuff and basically to just tell y'all my natural hair journey so without further ado we gonna get straight into the video so I'm gonna start off by telling y'all how long I've been natural because believe it or not believe it or not your girl used to get a perm all the time i used to get a perm i used to have perms in my hair i used to flatten my hair straighten my hair all the time damage 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 is basically what i'm saying so i have been natural since fourth grade i believe and being natural to me is not putting a perm in your head, not relaxed or nothing like that. I feel as though people think that natural means you can't straighten your hair, you can't blow dry, you can't do none of that, <laughs> baby. <laughs> if that's the case, I'm not natural now <laughs> because I blow dry my hair all the time. But I've been natural since fourth grade, I believe, because I used to get perms. Before fourth grade, I used to get perms all the time. My mom used to perm my hair, perm my hair, perm, 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 and it was just like damage okay but it was like when i was young young but that's how long i've been natural i've been natural since fourth grade and i'm now going to 11th grade junior upper class man okay so here's some pictures of my hair when it was permed and damaged as you can see my hair was permed it was always straightened i always used to straighten my hair i always wanted to straighten my hair knowing that i didn't really have hair my hair was so like it was so unhealthy it was had split ends it was just not a cute look at all another natural hair question that i always get is what is your hair type? I believe my, that my hair type is either 4B or 4C, a mixture of that, because the front of my hair is more loose curls than the back of my hair, it's like tighter. So, after I start putting burns and relaxers in my head, I never really had a big chop. Like, my mom flat ironed my hair one time and just cut it really short, but it was never a big chop, and that's a picture of that, my mom flat ironed my hair. But, once my mom stopped putting burns in my head, I just let my hair grow out and let the damage just come down and she cut it like that but a lot of people think that you have to do this you have to do that you gotta do this you gotta buy this product that product and that product all the products and in reality you really don't need all them products to make your hair grow because i definitely do not be using products to make my hair grow at least not that i know the only thing that i would suggest if you really want your hair to grow well first you have to eat well i heard that eating well people ask me if i get my hair trimmed the last time I got my hair trimmed was like probably a year ago, which is not a good thing, but my hair is still healthy. So I honestly feel as though there's not really a specific routine or specific product that you can use in order to make your hair grow, which is a thing that a lot of people get confused because you really do not have to have that product, this product, that product. But one thing you do need to make sure that you do is oil your hair, oil your scalp, oil all that because if your hair is dry and you're not taking care of it like you should definitely deep condition your hair very often when you wash your hair i also can say that you're not supposed to put the shampoo over your hair your hair your hair you're not supposed to do that a lot of people do that when they're washing their hair because they feel like yeah i'm getting it i'm killing it in my hair no you're not shampoo strips the moisture from your natural hair so when you use shampoo you're just supposed to you know put it in your scalp and just get everything out of your scalp you know scalp 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 <laughs> but um i'm gonna prepare a, a slideshow from y'all for y'all so y'all can see my actual natural hair journey and it's gonna be from like when i was younger to like growing up my natural hair journey when my mom cut off not cut my hair when my mom started trimming my hair and like stopped perming it so i'm gonna create a slideshow for you guys and that's what i'm gonna do and it's gonna be from then all the way to now and how gorgeous my hair is so I hope you all enjoy those clips. So here it is.
Also, one more thing, you should trim your hair at least every six months. Okay, so that's twice a year. But I don't really be trimming my hair like that, which is a bad thing. Because if I trim my hair, my hair probably will be a lot longer than it is now. One more question that I get asked a lot. Where do I get these clips from? Uh, I get them from this Instagram company. You know, don't sleep on Instagram. I'll tell y'all. If y'all might, y'all might know them. But it's the Instagram company that um does the hair paint. Um, But I'll leave all that in the description below. I love y'all so, so, so much. And if... You ain't subscribed to the gang gang gang, then make sure you do that because you lame if you not. I hope this video helped you all and I hope you all um, have a blessed day. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and send this video to someone that you think may like it or may need it or may need to hear something that I said in this video. So, ah, love you all. Roll to 200k for Princess J. Ah, toodles! <laughs>